Welcome back to another episode of How It Works. I'm Ken Baker from Green Pro Solutions, and today we're going to be talking about the fill systems. In this case, we have two different types of uh, fill systems that we're talking about. One has to do with this, this brass air gap, and the other one has to do with a, a four inch air gap between the system. Now, this has an outside cam coupler, two inch cam coupler, which comes from the outside, goes underneath, up through this two inch tiger hose and goes into a downspout and into this cone. Some states require that there's a four inch gap here uh, to separate from the tank to here. Now what's different about this fill system in comparison to the brass one I showed you earlier, um, this is the only place it gets filled into this 300. Now the pump will take it from the bottom of the tank which is the bottom of the manifold suction and pulls from there. Now the difference is this, this air gap system is that this will come from the um, hydrant or uh, garden hose or whatever, a stream pump. It will come up into here, come out here, and then it will go directly into the bottom of the suction manifold. And then you can distribute it to any tank that you want. So that's the difference between the brass air gap system and the top fill air gap system. Uh, so this is a little bit more diversified. Again, it's depending on what state you're in and what, where they require you to use this type of air gap. Now what we're going to do is go to the side of the vehicle and we're going to talk about the two, in, two inch cam coupler uh, that is used to fill both of these type of systems. Now this system here is the outside is a two inch cam coupler. It has a uh, red handle to be shut off. Now on this particular unit with an open air gap, uh, you have one valve right here. When you're using this system, there's usually another uh, valve on the inside that closes the fill system off from the manifold. Now if you don't shut that valve, uh, what, we, what you will do is it would suck air through the fill system if you don't shut that internal valve that goes to your suction manifold. Remember, the open air gap system only fills the 300 gallon tank. The brass system fills into the suction of the manifold and then is distributed from there. So we have to make sure that valve is closed on the inside behind the manifold. This one here only has to be shut just to the residual water that's all left in the line does not spill out after the fact. Now, the fill system here can be used by using a hydrant, if you have a hydrant permit, a stream pump, or we can reduce it from two inch down to garden hose if needed. So there's your uh, fill system. Uh, as far as troubleshooting, there really isn't anything to, with this particular system, the open gap system. Uh, this one here, typically there's two screws here. If it doesn't work and water comes out, it probably means that your diaphragm um, is uh, uh, worn out, dried out, just no good. You can just basically take these two screws off, take this cap off, and there's a diaphragm in there that you can replace if water for some reason is coming out when you're filling it. So that's the episode. Thank you for joining us uh, another episode of How It Works.